you guys have shown a, a bit of a more of a commitment to the run game uh, in recent uh, weeks. Uh, regardless of who's on the down, is that something you want to make sure you maintain? You maintain? Yeah, we'd like to, you know, be balanced and, um, you know, get get a little bit more efficiency on normal downs in the run game. Uh, but, you know, it's kind of lending toward our team's identity. You know, we play good defense. You know, we move the chains, control field position, um, you know, win the time of possession and all, and run the football helps with all that. Uh, but if it's not working, then we need to find another, you know, avenue by throwing the football, then that's what we'll do. Yeah, I mean, he's a pro, so he's going to be ready to go. Um, you know, I may not have gotten all the opportunities in practice, but we feel like he'll be ready to go if, you know, it's his number that gets called. Coach, you watch the games around the weekend at all, NFL? A little bit, you see yeah. You a lot of those comebacks that happened there late. I, I noticed that you guys typically in the fourth quarter have a way of kind of salting away games. What's your mindset and your approach to the fourth quarter when you have a, a one-score lead? Yeah, I mean, it's it's about putting the game away. And uh, sometimes it's, you know, controlling the ball and, and making sure that those possessions are, you know, going to your best players and making sure that, you know, we're calling the plays that feel like will give us the best opportunity to move the chains, um, you know. So third downs are critical. We've been fortunate to convert a couple big third downs. I know, you know just offhand the last few games we, we were able to, convert those and, and again turn some clock um, obviously the opponent depending on how many timeouts they have you know it's important uh, to save those to the very end so if we can use those up and get first downs get into scoring range make it a multiple score game then yeah that gives our defense a, a chance to pin their ear our, you know our ears back on their quarterback what do you see from Kilo the yeah he's been he's been well in the fourth quarter he's done well and um you know, again, we <clears throat> we want to make sure that that he's making good decisions, and you know, when it comes down to playing our best, the very end of the game is ultimately where where you need to play your your very best football. Um, and we learn through the course of the game how it's being played, and at the end, we need to make sure we're adapting and playing our best football. Then, yeah. George, you lose one guy at a position that's bad. You lose two guys at the same position. Starts to yeah. So when you lose a third guy, what's, what do you say? What's your reaction when you hear about something like that? Yeah, it's uh, you know, for for us, we we try not to dwell on that as much. I mean, I think you know, through the course of just a career of coaching, you know, there's been injuries. I've dealt with multiple quarterbacks. Uh, this year, we've had receiver issues, we've had line issues, centers. You know, we played four centers. Um, so, you know, the running back position, you know, it's just next in line. You know, we've been fortunate to be pretty healthy at the tight end position. So, um, you know, it's it's that time of, uh, you know, it's, it's today's issues that we're dealing with. So, um, at the beginning of the year, we, we know that there's a plan, and then there's a plan that we're not going to be ready for, and we're going to have to adapt. So, that's really where we're at. It's hard to say that about the tight end. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what well, you, uh, you talked on the development of Jerry Dukes, uh, what do you see in the practice? Yeah, it's the same thing, you know, he's been out here working and uh, he's been getting a lot of reps on the practice squad and uh, the show team. So, um, you know, the NFL is about seizing your opportunity and making the most out of it. And, um, you know, for our guys that have that opportunity, it's, it's uh, their responsibility to be ready to go. And then, um, you know, we're going to put them in the best uh, positions we can and then, you know that they, they need to perform when the ball's you know either given to them or they have an opportunity to to make a play. Yeah, and Dexter Williams, how much do you know about him? And, uh, just yeah, same thing. You know, we're like I said, these these guys are pros. Uh, they know that that's part of their their identity right now, and um, you know they're getting an opportunity, which is all they want. And uh, you know when they get that opportunity, it's making the best out of it. So we're happy to have Dexter. And,